Hello, this is Ian Nicholson from the Sydney Short Film School, um, and I'm going to show you very quickly how to manually sync uh, audio and video in uh, DaVinci Resolve 12. Now, <clears throat> I've got here a, a, uh, a video track and a corresponding audio file that goes with it. Um, but the uh, problem is the audio, uh, sorry, there is no audio on the, on the video at all. Um, it was actually, the microphone was turned off on the camera. Uh, so all we have to go on is the, uh, is the clapper, uh, syncing there. Uh, and, um, the audio of course is recorded from our digital recorder, just a mono track. Um, now ordinarily I might be able to use the, uh, auto sync feature if I were to select the two, um, items in the in the uh, media pool here uh, I could possibly do an auto sync uh, based on the waveform but because there's no waveform on the camera I'm forced to do this entirely manually and unfortunately it's not that clear to to do this in in DaVinci it's not very uh, straightforward or easy uh, to see um, but here's how you do it so first of all what I'm going to do is uh, find the uh, clapper in the video and I'm just going to step forward I'm just pressing the uh, right arrow key to step frame by frame and there's my uh, in point on my video so I'm going to press I on the keyboard to mark in or I could press the mark in uh, button here same thing um, and now what I'm going to do is I'm going to go up here and select this waveform uh, section here and you can see that um, what I'm looking at here now is the uh, the, the waveform for uh, uh, for this one here the, the Tascam 105.2 S12 uh, file here so what I can do now is just kind of scrub through this and you can see the peak of the, the, the clap there there it is and uh, that's my in point there. So I've got my in point marks on my video. Uh, I've got the cursor over the clap on the audio. And I'm just going to press this link button here. And what that's going to do is link this audio to this video and put it all in under the video. So when I click on that link button now, uh, we see the uh, timeline controller for the waveform is gone and if I select my audio track now I can hear the audio in there she started without uh, before the direct call action so um, if I go to the edit now uh, if I just simply pull that video down you can see there now is the audio and that's how you do it that's how you sync uh, manually sync your audio and video in DaVinci Resolve 12 well my name is Ian Nicholson from the Sydney Short Film School thank you for watching and uh, please subscribe to our channel so uh, you can stay in touch with all these kind of cool things as I discover them as we go <laughs> thanks for watching have a great day